American Idol mm. coming back right here on News 8 and ABC. Looking forward, people lined up in our state yesterday to compete for a ticket that could put them on the path to superstardom. All right, News 8's Brian Spires is here now with all the details. A lot of fun to be had. I wasn't there, but it looked like a lot it of fun. It looked like fun, So, right? yes, it did. 300 people auditioning for Connecticut Idol on Tuesday at Mohegan Sun. News 8, a part of it all. The goal to be one of the finalists and get a silver ticket. That ticket will give them the chance to audition for American Idol down in Savannah, Georgia. Some familiar faces here at News 8 judging those contestants, all of them with one goal in mind to become the next big star. Now, as we know, that's not really easy this to do, but they're giving it a try anyway. Here's a sample of the talent that was there. You stole my happy, you made me cry, took the lonely and took me for a ride. I heard church bells ring. I threw my hands in the air, said, show me something. And you asked me to stay over, I said I already told you, I think that you should give you some raise. Not bad, better than if I was to sing. Of the 300 people, of the 300 people who tried out, only five of them will be getting a silver ticket. We'll announce those winners tonight on News 8 at 5. And I hear that, Jocelyn, you may be one of them for your rendition of Oh Christmas, oh, Christmas Tree. Tree. Yeah, I've so always wanted to good? be a rocker, Brian. Well, now's your chance. Okay. Yeah. We All shall right. see, as they say, right? Exactly. Yes, we Brian, thank you. Yep.